Hey, we're Kaser, and welcome back to the Tavern Trouble Update. Well, I've already actually tapped the thumbs up, and then the game crashed on me, and now we got some dialogue. I think you should call it a night, Homer. You've had a few too many. I'm fine, I'm fine. Look, Homer, even a divorced mouse on a cheese farm can't afford his legal fees. What's with this place? I said I'm fine, and you to you when I say that, the bartender just gets me another beer. Come on, drunkie, let's go. What are you gonna do, shoot me? Because you can't, you lost your gun years ago. Is that true, Chief? I really looked everywhere for it. Pointing. The thing in this holster is really just a label maker. I know, because Marge has the same one. Well, for that, I'm labeling you Night in the Drunk Tank. Ha, that's too many letters. Oh, I've got letters. Shrieks, run! Did he just yell run to himself? I believe he did, Lou. I believe he did. Now, should we order more chicken tenders? Good idea, Chief. Oh, order some for me too. Into radio. Dispatch 223. Tender to last scene heading south. Three more baskets needed. Also, some ranch reinforcements would be great. So we've gotten Tippy McStaggers. The bendy elbow, and now something about a clock. Clock o clock somewhere. Clock aware. Five o'clock somewhere. I'm drunk, which means I need to find a nice, comfortable bar to get me even more drunk. Oh, this place has food too. Welcome to Ramen Coma. What can I get you? I'll take a mega ramen bowl with extra chasu. Oh, and two beers. Hey, you look familiar. Have you ever been to a gross, sticky tavern with a mean bartender who's always kicking people out with a shotgun? Yeah, I've been there once or twice. I used to work there when it was called Flaming Moe's. Oh yeah, I remember you. Mo hired you when he needed extra help. I'm Homer. Homer, that's right. I'm Colette. So what brings you out here tonight? Well, I used to be a regular at Moe's, but now I hate him because not only did he steal my Flaming Homer drink, but now, he's making it seem like he was the one who invented it. So, you told him you are never going to go back to a stupid tavern again? Wait, how do you know I said that? Shrugs. It just seems like something where your story was headed. Anyway, Mo probably doesn't even care that I'm never going back to a stupid tavern again. You might be surprised, Homer. Slip some ramen and listen to a bit of advice from someone who was there when it all happened. Good idea. Let me just uh, move that. There we go. Those are the stats for that, including gluttony rating. Kaboom! Five o'clock somewhere. So, are there any windows at this place? I guess the front would have windows. I might actually have to move this thing. Hold on. Because it's going to be pretty much impossible to tap as well. If the pandan holds true, then this should sound pretty similar to the other ones with a lot of people talking for the sound. Also, I think it was the last one, the bendy elbow. It sounds exactly the same as another one that I found. I'll show you in a second. But first, let's tap 5 o'clock somewhere and hear all those people talking. A happy hour never ends. That's the pouring of beer, which I thought was going to be from the previous one, but it wasn't. Uh, let's see, what do we got next here? Homer put on a parker before slipping more ramen, and that's it. So does that mean that the cops would be going here? Wiggum, Eddie, Lou, etc. I'm going to have to check them. Now let me just show you the other building for a second. Which is the bendy elbow. And the other building I found, which is exactly the same, is. I believe Knockers. Oh, wait, no, Knockers is similar to. Tipsies. Yeah, 
Yes. So Nakus is exactly the same as Tipsy's, and then the bendy elbow is pretty much exactly the same as well, but it's the clinking of glasses. Just in case you were curious, or cared. So I am following Chief Wiggum. Apparently, they have a quest that goes to the 5 o'clock summers. I know that because when I clicked the quest, and then I clicked the building, it said they were going to the building. I stored the building really, really quickly, so I don't know what the animation is. <laughs> but this quest is called, and it's a six hour quest. Tell everyone what a hero he is. Not sure how you're supposed to know that, but that's what it is. Ah, yeah. So for the animation, I think... Well, the lights will turn on and the door will open up. Well, the door doesn't open up. And actually, I really like the windows. I like the fact that they look like clocks as well and they light up. Like clocks. No smoke either, no sign lighting up, but the windows do pop a lot, which I really, really enjoy. So at least that's the first two prizes I've been able to find the characters for them. Or what they could do, and I think I might have said this before, is that when you tap a building like so, beside the quest on the top there, have a portrait of Wiggum. So you at least know that a character can go to that, which is Wiggum. I think that would help a lot, because then you know, okay, Wiggum at least has the quest here, let's try to figure out what the quest is. I'm just saying, I think that would be a good idea. Because clearly they don't have quests and dialogue anymore for for buildings and stuff, like these. So you don't know. Needle in the haystack, man, needle in a haystack. But yeah, that is 5 o'clock summers. Stay tuned tomorrow for the next bar in this update, the Tavern Trouble update, and the Simpsons Tap Down. So thank you everybody so much for watching. And I'll see you view on the next one. Bye, everybody.